Hey, what's up guys? So today is another Thankful Thursday and today is a very special thing for Thankful Thursday because I love how Thursday, of course, um, Thanksgiving happening, happening to fall on a Thursday because, you know, that's kind of a thing. <laughs> so um, today's Thankful Thursday. My Thanksgiving dinner is actually going on right now, but I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of the uh, family that I'm thankful for and all the people who are around me within it. So you know, it'll probably just be a few clips because apparently that's more so the style that my channel is driving towards at this point. It's just fun to be able to just take video clips of random things that happen, but yeah. So, Thankful Thursday, all about my wonderful family and our wonderful food, I must say, for this wonderful Thanksgiving that we have together. And, um, one thing for me, uh... I, this is kind of just a standpoint that I wanted to make before we got into everything else, but, um, so this whole Grey Thursday, Black Friday before Black Friday sort of stuff, uh, if you guys are gonna do it, cool, more power to you. Um, my thing is just, I personally am not a fan of it, because I feel like Thanksgiving's just time to be with your family, not worry about the commercialism of life and all of that. I mean, like, as soon as your Thanksgiving, I mean... Exhibit A with myself, as soon as my Thanksgiving is done, like right around like 7.30, 8 o'clock-ish, I'm jetting out of here and I'm going to go pick up uh, Taylor so that we can all go down to, uh, so him and I and our other friend Bree are going to go Black Friday shopping, and I'm completely cool with that because that is after the festivities of uh, Thanksgiving and all of that, so I'm not like, it'll be 10 o'clock-ish probably by the time we get out there. But, you know, that's not a big deal to me. But, um, I just feel that Thanksgiving should be appreciated for what it is. Because, honestly, Thanksgiving is one of my favorite holidays. And the reason why it is, is because this is a time where the whole family is together. And everyone's just happy for who's around them. And it doesn't get much better than that, you know? Just, we're all there, we're all appreciating each other, and, <laughs> well... Sometimes more than others, I understand, because you always have, like, crazy aunt, weird uncle, that cousin who likes to stick glue up his nose. I don't know. I don't know whatever you want to talk about, but yeah. But we're all there. We're all family. We're all connected somehow, and we all love each other. So isn't that good enough for today, at least? So that's kind of my two cents on Thanksgiving. And specifically, I would just like to say thank you. To all of those wonderful people who are around me, thank you to my parents, because somehow they got me through my early childhood and into my more adult years. Thank you to my friends, who have always been there for me. Uh, of course, you guys always are changing. Like, my friends that I had years ago are not the same friends that I have now, or at least not, like, the close-knit ones. But thank you, my friends, for always having my back whenever I need you, because... There's always at least one of you out there who's willing to listen to me when I have things I need to talk about. So, yeah. And then, thank you, special shout out, to our little furry friends that we have as well. Because uh, this is one of the other things that I've noticed while I've been home. But, like, my dogs are some of my best friends. I love to see Bruiser, Roscoe, Scotty. I actually have little individual videos for the three of them. Well, kind of, but yeah. I'm gonna, they're in, in this precursor. Anyway, <laughs> so I really appreciate having them around because they're just furry, they're happy, and it's as simple as that. Uh, as well, I have a cat who lives downstairs. Her name is Yo-Yo, and she's my itty-bitty baby, and I love her so much. And a uh, special shout-out to her as well because while she doesn't get quite as much attention as the dogs because she's downstairs, she, like, owns the whole basement, that sort of stuff, but... They, she doesn't get seen as often. Yeah. She's just... She's a sweetheart. And she's been around for almost as long as I have been. So I think that's an accomplishment in and of itself. Anyway, let us move on to the Thanksgiving festivities then. Food, friends, and... Well, mostly family. <laughs> There's a lot of things to be thankful for today. And this little pug is definitely one of them. Oh, hi. You see, I'm talking about you. Mm-hmm. This is my little bruiser. He's a nice guy. He's a nice little pucker. As well... Scotty! There's my boy. My wonderful dog, Scotty, who I am also very thankful for. He's fluffy 
and dirty about 99% of the time, even if you just barely had him take a bath. Oh, hey. <laughs> but he is adorable, and he looks like he's a little Snoopy kind of dog, and he's a lot of fun. So yeah, I'm happy for that. And where did Roscoe go? Roscoe! One sec. <laughs> Scotty down. Rah. Rah. Roscoe's under this chair. <laughs> Scotty, get down. This is my little guy, Roscoe. He's a oh, there, cute little pug. And he's super chill. Maybe he'll turn his head around and say hi. Roscoe. Let's go, buddy. Oh, see? There he is. He's a little cutie. And super chill. And just overall a nice puppy. He's our old man pug, but still. He's still spray like the rest of them, right? Nah, 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 nah. But you guys should seriously see him sometimes when he starts fighting with Scotty. <laughs> it's pretty funny because he has a bit of a bark to him. Which you wouldn't think so. I mean, look at that face. Roscoe. Roscoe. Look at that face. Just adorable. <laughs> this is really what Thanksgiving is all about. Let's all be honest right now. Thank you guys all for watching, and I hope that you've had a very wonderful Thanksgiving with your family. Uh, yeah, so just hope it's all peaceful, good food, good friends if you don't have family to be around at this time of the year. And above all else, now that Thanksgiving is over, I will not gripe whatsoever about listening to Christmas music and having Christmassy stuff going on, because I love Christmas, honestly. It's just like, Thanksgiving is nothing, you know? So, there's that. Did this just barely start? Anyway. <laughs> Thank you all for watching, because it has been a very fun time hanging out with you tonight. And I really hope that you had a wonderful Thanksgiving, or are having a wonderful Thanksgiving, depending on when this video gets up. So, yeah. I hope that it has been treating you well. You had much good food, good friends, if you don't have your family to be around you in this time of the season. Or just family just because. Or friends just because. I mean family. <laughs> Whatever. I hope your friends, your family, your cat, your dog, your goldfish, you're all having fun. <laughs> so yeah. Anyway. But most importantly, I'm not going to worry about all this Christmassy sort of stuff. And Christmas music, Christmas decorations, all of that. And to show proof of this, because, you know, now it's past Thanksgiving, I will now accept that Christmas stuff can be up and all that. Yeah, my mom already has a second Christmas tree up. <sighs> no complaints about it now. And honestly, it looks pretty nice. You gotta admit, that's a pretty nice looking Christmas tree. Because it's a white Christmas tree, so I mean, like, it's tasteful. <laughs> all right, guys, I hope that you've had a great day, had a wonderful Thanksgiving, and had very much food and stuff your bellies full of goodness and family fun. Well, don't stuff your bellies with family fun, because I imagine that wouldn't turn out too well. But hope you had family fun and stuffed your bellies. All right, guys, I hope you're having a great day, and this is CJ signing off, and as always, keep smiling. See ya.